notice. Hey. If you weren't a doctor, what would you be doing? Probably be a librarian. Love it. Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, or Instagram? Twitter. Awesome. You were in the U.S. Public Health Service, so what's one leadership skill that you would uh, want to bring from the, the Public Health Service to your career? Uh, caring about the troops and caring about people that you work with. What's the most optimistic discovery you've learned about cancer treatment in the past five years? We're starting to be able to figure out cancer at a molecular level, and we're figuring out there's no such thing as one breast cancer. There's probably 80 or 120. That's insane. What's the biggest milestone to have happened since we started the fight against cancer? Uh, the 22% drop in mortality rate from 1991 to now. What's one bad habit you wish the whole world could break? Smoking. In one sentence, how has access to quality cancer care changed over the last 20 years? We've started realizing that access is a problem, but unfortunately it's a growing problem. There's less access to high quality care today than there was 15 years ago really crazy. So if you could pick a superpower, what would it be? Healing. So many people don't even realize that obesity is the number two cause of cancer. What are the top three tips to living a healthy lifestyle? First off, not smoking. Second, exercise. And third, eat a diet that has a lot of fruits and vegetables in it. Awesome. So what's your spirit animal? Probably a panda. Dig it. What's your favorite holiday? The 4th of July. Why is that? It's my birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. What's, uh, if you could live underwater or in outer space, which one would you pick? Outer space. What's the proudest moment of your life? The first time I actually caused a complete remission in a lymphoma patient. What was their reaction to that? Well, she was thrilled. I was probably even more thrilled. It's like, it's like winning the Super Bowl by scoring the winning touchdown. Touchdown. Puppies or kittens? Puppies. Um, who would play you in the movie version of your life? Obviously Denzel Washington. Obviously. We recently heard you speak on NPR. Do you get nervous dur during interviews? Me get nervous about an interview? Of course not. <laughs> so we know that you graduated from the University of Chicago. Deep dish or thin crust? Oh, deep dish. <laughs>